Good morning from Ubud. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. We finally made it. So we have a full day today. Oh yeah, so many things to do. Yeah, so we're gonna grab some breakfast. Uh, we're gonna do what temple. We're gonna do rice, rice fields, fields, the swing. Yeah, monkey forest monkey today. Forest. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, unless we have a pl change of plan, then we may have to like you know have one of those tomorrow or something like that. The great thing about Ubo, there's so much to do. We may we may change our plans as we go depending on how we're feeling but that's the plan starting out so guys this is how the villa looks in the daytime man we also have a river um, that runs through the property and bamboo as well nice pool we arrived a few moments ago so first impression like quaint little spot so here's a quick look around Uh, it's a cloudy day, so I'm not sure how we're going to do it today. But we may have to change some of our plans. But that's the beauty of being here for a few days. You can ebb and flow. Okay. Stopped at a quaint little cafe, um, Luna Casa, right in the middle of Ubud. And we have got some seats right on the outside so we can keep a watch and more of an order. What did you order, babe? Uh, sourdough crumpet to start. I like this uh, salt and pepper, how that's served as well. It's like a banana leaf. Yeah, yeah. that's pretty cool. Yeah. So, guys, having a uh, curry ayam. Ayam is chicken, so curry chicken here. <laughs> Rest of my coconuts finish. What you have, hon? This is a potato pancake um, with smoked salmon. So everything on the menu looks really good. So, oh yeah. Yes. <laughs> so. So all our plans have now been derailed because they're all outdoors and now it's raining. So oh, yeah. we're switching. Thank goodness we have multiple days here. So we're going to do some indoor activities. So oh, yeah. yeah, stay tuned. Here we are at the wood carving shop right outside of a bud. So impressed how intricate, elaborate and stunning each piece is. A variety of wood from crocodile, mahogany and even hibiscus wood. While everyone is super friendly, just be aware because it was obvious that tourists is the target. About to check out some painting. Really? Okay. They were put to tourists. They were put to tourists. Yeah. Very pretty inside, and babe. waiting for me. This multi-level art boutique is stunning with at least two courtyards a nice variety of modern and contemporary art pieces and apparently the work of famous Balinese artists just well done very pleasant to stroll around and take in each masterpiece while the art pieces are absolutely beautiful be sure to shop around and compare your prices Pura Pusa Temple this, this belongs to the Batuan village Batuan village yeah. So this temple is the one of the three main temples here in the, on this village. So every six months you do a ceremony. Yes. And once a year. Yeah, and once a year. Okay. And then also we do the small ceremony every day. Yeah. So this is the main temple area, and then the priest sits behind us and the ceremony starts in here so we're here at monkey forest oh, yeah. so the rain held up so we made it here so at the entrance we are greeted by some japanese koi oh yeah so now we're in the middle of the park so we're gonna walk around and check it out marv the thing will scratch your face don't go so close eh <laughs> Yeah. 
<laughs> monkey forest is more impressive than we expected it is a huge green and lush park with hundreds of monkeys roaming freely and you better watch your personal items like your bag <laughs> as the monkeys will try to confiscate them. <laughs> So what do you think of monkey forest, hon? So it was a beautiful nature walk, so I really do like it, but my heart's racing because I'm scared, nervous and scared of the monkeys. Though they're not aggressive by nature, but you have to be aware of your luggage or bag. So Yeah, don't bring best, in the bags, guys. It's best not to bring anything, maybe only your camera. <laughs> yeah, some can be quite aggressive as well. And then you can see if they think you have food, they'll come get it. stuck in traffic for over an hour now <laughs> we're trying to get to dinner but um, there's a lot of traffic in the bud there was a ceremony which we caught very beautiful ceremony but as a result traffic is very intense traffic everywhere guys so we're so hungry so <laughs> hopefully you have an appetite eh, babe I do uh -huh. so we finally arrived like two hours later for a trip that should have taken only like 10 to 15 minutes. Oh yeah, long trip, the traffic <laughs> yeah. was really, really Yeah, it was like standstill long. traffic, but we're at Indus, so the menu looks really good. So we're excited to try some of these dishes. Yeah, okay, ready to so eat, hungry. Our drinks just kind of came. So looking forward to it. Okay. So everything smells so good. The table is so fragrant right now. So oh yeah. You have an appetizer here, spring rolls, corn fritters and chicken satay and some roti with sauce. Oh yeah. Yeah. Crumbly, coconut crumbly. So we're heading out, so the plan is Rice Terrace as well as um, Swing and then maybe a day club. Jones Bach! <laughs> so he's figured it out. You actually woke up early this morning to get it synchronized. Oh yeah. <laughs> Guys, we stopped by this cute coffee shop. Actually, not a coffee shop. Emery thought it was a coffee shop, but it's a restaurant. Tex-Mex. Tex-Mex. So we got a rice field view. We're gonna have a breakfast here. Oh. oh no no latte. Yes, they do it so beautifully here. So every single coffee shop we've been to, very nice design. Guys, I eat nachos at breakfast. So chicken burrito. Curry with breakfast tacos. Breakfast tacos. With egg whites. With egg whites. So guys, we're on the way to Tegalalang. All right. <laughs> I think I got that right. Oh yeah. <laughs> so just driving, Maddie have us going here. <laughs> Let's travelers. This is Tegalalang. We're here. So this is the rice terrace. Yes, it's very beautiful here. Green, verdant, oh, yeah. lots of trees like banana, coconut, papaya. Yeah, super nice. Even from above, like the view is amazing. Yeah, the terraces are nice as well. So you have different layers and then the rice terraces uh, with the water, um, the planting as well. I think it's planting season now as well. Yeah. <laughs> So guys, Emery's all the way up there. Say hello, hon, the mother. <laughs> Here, walking back up, guys. How are the stairs, babe? Oh, yeah. 
Oh, sweaty. <laughs> Mate's here. Mate's here. Mate, you're up here, man, with yeah. Anne Marie. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Mexico. Hey, Mexico. Hey, Mexico. Hey, Mexico. Hey, Mexico. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you are YouTuber? Yeah, you yeah. too. <laughs> uh, say hello. Hi. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> so we just got to Aras Arum. So we are at Creta. In Alas Arum. Here have many things. You have the coffee demonstration here. Yeah. The roast and the beans on this side. Oh yeah, roast and beans. Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool. Hello. Hello. What's going on here? Are you roasting the beans? Roasting coffee. Okay, coffee. This place is like an adult's playground. You got swings, several of them. You have circles and hearts to take pictures. You have hanging bridges. Oh yeah, there's <laughs> a lot going on here. So must visit guys, Alas Saron in Bali. <laughs> Welcome to the sky! Oh, 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 no, there she goes! There goes Han! I see you! So Han's getting down. I think she had fun. How do you feel Han? So it was exciting, you know, exhilarating and scary at the same time. Oh yeah, so you made it. But still fun, fun, and but it's raining a little bit, so hey, I'm wet now. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so when you've had enough of the playground on that side, like singing, pictures, biking, whatever, then you can head over to the adjacent side, and then you have this beautiful, you know, multi-layered pool. So we're gonna try and get a seat. Hopefully they have something available. So Mark can cool down because he's really sweaty walking up and down their stairs. Oh yeah, I am. This is totally a vibe. Oh yeah, cool. <laughs> so we wanted a cabana, but they're all taken for today. So we're just gonna have a lunch, and I think tomorrow Marvin wants to come back. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm coming back early. I already have a cabana reserved. Yes, it's um, very humid here, so so hot. I'm sweaty, guys. You're looking so, gross right now. We're gonna have a lunch. Oh, here it comes. Oh. Here's our lunch right here. <laughs> Please enjoy. Thank you. So that's Anne Marie's lunch. Yeah. Guys, right now we're in Ubud Center walking around, checking out the shops and then seeing what we come across. Yeah, so this here is the King's Palace, King of Ubud. Um, okay. The palace is right here and they're doing their um, ceremony right now actually. Oh yeah, so we're gonna see, we don't understand it fully but we'll check out some of it. So we're entering the waterfall. What's this waterfall, Mari? Teganungan waterfall. Teganungan. I'll say that one more time. Teganungan waterfall. Yeah. So there are some shops at the entrance. The first view of the waterfall. So oh, wow. Yeah. Here's another viewpoint oh, of yeah. the day club and the waterfall. So Bali has tons of waterfalls. So, so many. Yeah. So steep steps down. Super, super, super serene. I mean, the waterfall, like powerful, yet so peaceful. You're surrounded by this lush jungle. Like, there's little mini falls all around the mm -hmm. so, As well, you know, guys, lots of jungle in Bali. Jungles yes, in Bali. Yes, very nice. And you have the interesting rock formation oh, yeah. throughout this entire area. And so this is how you get to the waterfall guys, you cross and I'm coming next. That's it, off to the next stop. 
was awake. I'm definitely awake now. So there was quite a mist coming from the waterfall. Oh yeah, very wet down there, guys. Bring a towel. <laughs> All right, we're taking on our steps. They're steep, 165 to the top. So let's go, babe. <laughs> Even there are lots of stores where you can get coconuts and souvenirs. Drinks. And drinks. <laughs> mm. We're back. We're back. Yep. Mr. Marvin wanted to come back. Oh so yeah, absolutely. Says, he said, welcome back, Mr. Marvin. Oh yeah. <laughs> Big mom's back. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, we're gonna chill out here for the next few hours. Yeah. So, pro tip, make sure you reserve a cabana or daybed if you come in here because they go very fast. So, yeah, or show up early. Show up early by 12, that is. Yeah. Time to order some food. Guys, the natural sounds here, love it, you know? So, we're gonna be leaving this villa today and heading to Cinnamon. So, Maddie will pick us up in a couple hours, but I'm gonna enjoy the last uh, couple hours in this pool. Anne-Marie doesn't feel well, but also, the water is cold for her, guys. <laughs> She's not coming in. So, she has a double whammy today so i'll enjoy this so hans having her soup yes i'm not feeling so well not covid i think i got a stomach bug though okay so, you're eating light so hun what's this it's really good these are buckwheat pancakes okay and probably the best pancakes i've had since i've been here They're oh wow healthy. Okay, best pancake mm. since you've been here. So, Han, what do you like about this villa? So, the final thoughts about the villa is it's really nice. I really love these glass doors, so floor to ceiling. So, imagine just sleeping out in kind of nature. So, kind of brings the nature in. So, it's very nice like that. I think you like the pool. Oh yeah, the pool is nice, and it's um infinity edge, and it, it's it's nice. Yeah, I think knowing what we know now about a good, it would have been nice to stay somewhere a little bit closer to good center. So here in, we're in the village, the local village, but there's not a whole lot of shops and restaurants close by. So it'd be nice to kind of walk, be able to walk out. So I think next time we'll do that. And some villas are in the villages, but those villages have shops and restaurants. So those could work as well. This one didn't. Villa is beautiful love it during the daytime especially because it's so open but at night not so much when it's it's dark outside so it's not connected on the inside so you have to um, basically come from the bedroom into this living room if you want to at night but um, other than that it's been great post been great and really enjoy this spot so saying goodbye to a book guys so we're go heading to cinnamon Oh yeah, we're gonna be staying in a bamboo house, so that's super exciting. Looking forward to that. Yes, thank you for watching our videos. Be sure to like, share, and if you're not a subscriber, hit the subscribe button to yeah. join our community. Drop a comment as well and like and share. Yes, until next time, uh, love yourself, others, and gratitude for everything under the sun. One love. Uh -huh.